All right, I'm back with the Samurai Only playthrough, and last time we invaded the eastern half of Sturgeon. We summoned the Bannermen, we marched, and we took their settlements. The eastern half of Sturgeon is now ours. We have pushed them across the river, and we've left them with three settlements and four castles. So, since we still have the army still assembled, the Bannermen are with us. We may as well march across this river and take the fight to Sturgeon once more. Today we bring an end to the Sturgeons. We are going to conquer all of their remaining land. We're going to hit the castle first. We're going to march on the settlement. Then we're going to swing it up this coastal way. And then we'll come down for the finale here. And once we take this castle here, that lines us up nicely with the Batanians. Oh man, are we actually going to go to war with Britannia? This could be it. This could be it. Alright men, it is time to bring down the first of the Sturgeon castles today. There's only 300 defenders in here and there's 2,000 of us. Oh god! We're under heavy fire men! Spread out! Oh man. The ballistas. The ballistas. Gotta take this man out before he kills any more of us. Let's go in for the long shot. Come on. Whee! 60, no, 80 meters away. We'll take it. We'll take it. And we get the other one as well. Alright, adjust for the wind. Gotta feel the arrow, lads. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> How about here? There we go. 84 meters away. Alright, the siege tower has arrived. We are going up. The goal here is to take down the ballistas as fast as we can. That, that is the only goal here. The infantry is on my right, so we're going left for Ballista 1. That is Ballista 1 eliminated. Now we have a bit of a situation here. I can't reach any of the Ballistas with this army of Sturgeons in the way. Oh no. Okay, this is fine. We just gotta keep cutting our way through, men. Come on. We're almost there. Alright. We can slip past and move on to Ballista 2. Assuming it is upstairs. There it is. Ballista 3 is in my sights as well. That is Ballista 2 down. 2 to go. Oh, hang on. The lads are already here. How's it going, lads? Oh, that dude smacked him with that stick. Well, I think this siege is over. The Sturgeons are retreating back to the keep. We have invaded yet another castle. Alright, now that the castle has fallen, we march onto the settlement. There is nothing that can stop us now. Alright, it is time to bring down this settlement. I brought in the trebuchets. We got the big guns this time. Mainly because their walls were full of catapults. And I was not entering this castle while there was a single catapult on that wall. The battering ram has arrived. Bring down the gate, men. Come on. Put your backs into it. Oh, okay, lads. We'll just stand here waiting, you know. It's not like we're being shot or anything. 
Any second now. Ah, <laughs> oh god, where'd that spear come from? Did someone throw that at the wall? Or did someone get hit so hard it just launched out their hands? Oh no, it's this one. We're trapped in a box. Quick lads, we're just stuck in our box. We gotta get out of here. Oh no. What have we done? What have we unleashed? Right, if we can push them back out of this tunnel, we win this fight. We just gotta get out of the tunnel. They're hitting me, lads. They're hitting me. Oh man, they've pushed us into the box. How, how are they pushing us back? Come on, men. Actually, this is great. Let them in, lads, and we can swarm them. If they want out of the tunnel, let them out. I mean, it's great for us. They can't shield wall if they're in the open. How many sturgeons are there? Oh god. When will this end? We're pushing them back into the tunnel. Is this it? Have we got them on the run? We're in! We're kind of in. The backup has arrived. Right, let, let me just push past, lads. Let me get out of here. Here we go. This is more like it. Now we just slice from behind. And we're done here. Oh, man. Sturgeon's shield walling in a tunnel is pretty effective. <laughs> Honestly, if they didn't push out of their tunnel and go into the courtyard with us, they probably would have held a, a lot longer. Pushing out here is what got them killed. But hey yo, another settlement goes to the Tetsujin. We have taken the settlement and that has now filled in the gap between that castle and the land here. The only issue is, someone is trying to siege my castle again. So, we're going to have to march on over, see what's going on over there, and, uh, well, give whoever's sieging my castle a jolly good beating. And then we'll make our way up here and take the remainder of Sturge's land. The Batanians have stolen our castle, but they're still inside the castle. So, we're going to trap them in here, and we're going to punish them. <laughs> Hold up, the Batanians have sent reinforcements. I mean, there's not enough reinforcements, buddy. Hold on. He's running for my other settlement. You son of a... Lads, we gotta hurry up here. Alright, we must dispatch of the battalions as quick as possible. Because we need to march to our other settlement and then dispatch of more battalions as quick as possible. The battalions are slowing down the Sturgeon invasion. All right, we're going in. We must cut them down, men. Don't leave a single one alive. The battalions have to learn. You can't march on the Tetsujin and get away with it. There's ninjas everywhere. It's annoying because they have proper Tetsujin armor, which means our weapons are useless. Oh no! No! Men! Men, I require assistance! Okay, swing it wide, swing it wide, we need to slide... Oh no, no, no! 
Oh no, the Emperor's getting a beating. The Emperor is getting a beating. Alright, we'll go out swinging, lads. I'll cut down as many as I can. Oh god, they really do want me dead. Never mind, they have been distracted by the door. <laughs> Come on then, buddy. It's just you. There we go. And now the men are here to help. Great. Great stuff, lads. Not like I could have done with your assistance five minutes ago. We have retaken the castle, but now we must march and find that Batanian army. We don't know where it... Oh, the city is being sieged. I think we know where it went. <laughs> Did everyone from all over the Tetsujin Empire show up to kill this Batanian army? There's 3,000 of us? We have two horses running straight for us. This, this is an interesting strategy. We missed. We missed. We hit the horse. Hey lads, I'm not I'm not the only archer on this team, you know. There we go. That's one of you. And the other guy's fleeing. Take that as a warning, my friend. Alright, archers, rain fire on the battalion troops. If we can kill enough of them in the woods here, they should come marching out and meet us on the field. Come on, man, I'm not seeing an awful lot of killing going on. In fact, I'm not seeing any killing. Oh, that's two. We got our third one. A couple more and they will break formation. We have done it. They have broke formation and they are marching out of the woods. Good shooting, men. Good shooting. Horse archers, attack. Cavalry, attack. Infantry, on me. We're going in, lads. It's time to clean up here. We are done. Charge, men! Maybe we should... I think we charged a bit too early. Uh, let's back her up a little bit. Charge, men! <laughs> we, uh, we got a little ahead of ourselves, lads. I won't lie. Well, I think it's safe to say the Batanian army didn't stand a chance. They really didn't. I'm trying to like kill a few, but I keep getting hit by horses. There's just so much cab everywhere. Are there any enemies? I'm just going to swing. If I hit one, we hit one, lads. Any enemies? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Oh, no. We hit a horse. I thought we had one then. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got some enemies. Ah, we got a couple there. But overall, I think this siege is over, isn't it? I th well, I say siege, this battle. Oh, man. We've been sieging so many castles and settlements. I, I don't even know what we're doing anymore. But either way, we're done here. We're done. All right. Hopefully, that is the last of the distractions we're going to face for now. And we can continue our march on Sturge's land. Alright, no more distractions. We're bringing down the next Sturgeon settlement. I want a trebuchet fire right by there, lads. Come on, I expect to see a flying rock take about ten of them. Any second now. No? no. Alright. I understand. I'm disappointed, but I understand. 
you want something done, you gotta do it yourself. So I'm gonna have to manually shoot all these just standing by here. We got this rapid fire mode, men. Rapid fire. Hold on, where are the infantry marching to now? Little advice, lads. Point your shields at the enemies. That might uh, increase survival chances. Oh, no. Oh, what, are we, what have we done? All right, stick man. It's just me and you, buddy. It's just me and you. Let's push them back. Oh, it's me and two stick men. Come on, lads. We can break through the shield wall. Just push them backwards off the wall if we have to. <laughs> That'll work just as good. Alright, we're in. I'm just going to follow the wall this way. There's a lot of archers around here. Please don't shoot me, lads. Oh, no. This is fine. This is fine. Swipe. Cut this dude for here. Cut you. I'll cut you. We're going to pick up a rock for good luck. There's a lot of you coming up those stairs. Another rock for... Oh, shit. Uh, this might be it for us, lads. This might be it. Oh, uh, run. We can do this. Oh, no. We've run into more of them. I don't know where I'm going. What we're doing here. We're running for our life. And I've run into even more of them. This has backfired. <laughs> oh, no, we got swarmed. This is what happens when you run away from the army. We should have stuck with the lads. We did manage to kill 50 before we got taken out, though, so I'll take it. So I mentioned a while back that I was going to have a handcrafted katana, a mighty sword worthy of an emperor himself. But we never found a new smith. So, instead of having a hassle, since we're always away at war, we don't have time to look for really good companions. So the emperor has taken it upon himself to become a smith of his own. <laughs> so over time, every time we stop at a settlement, I am going to like refine some stuff, smelt down some weapons. And we're just going to try and level our smithing ourselves, so that we can hand make our own mighty katana. But while I was leveling up my smithing, I noticed our athletic skill leveled up and we got a new skill point. And look at this, guys. Decrease fall damage by 50%. Sign me up. <laughs> no more shall the emperor fall off a wall and die. <laughs> this is why in the modern day, right? This is why there's rules and regulations. The state, every stairs has to have a railing and stuff so you don't fall off and support, you know? It's people like us. Without those railings, I probably would have fallen to my death already. <laughs> But either way, we have taken the settlement, but there has been a slight change of plans. So I was originally going to march up here, remove these two, and then make my way down here. But Sturger is willing to sign peace, and a lot of my lords are supporting that peace. So it won't be long, I think, until this war is over. I think the men are just getting tired of all the wars going on. And if we have a chance for one to end where they're paying us, they're probably going to take it. So, we're going to march down here instead, because at least if I take these two castles before the peace treaty, we're bordering Britannia, ready for the Britannian War, and we can leave Sturger in this corner, just like how we've left the Asarai in this corner. As long as the Sturger don't declare another war on us, I'll leave them be. If they start another war, I will personally go up there and end their bloodline. But for now... <laughs>
We're gonna take these two castles. All right, here we go. Another castle must fall. Have we got a little texture bug there? Oh, I think we do. We've sieged a castle like this before. Basically, you wait on the left-hand side for your siege equipment to arrive. You can't be shot by anyone. Life is good, you know? <laughs> Hang on. The little peepers. We got little peepers. Can't see a peeper in there. These peepholes are a bit hard to uh, see in, to be honest with you, lads. The enemy are just shooting from the shadows. We're going to push with the men this time. We aren't going to run around on our own like we usually do. We're with the men. Actually, are they even... Oh! That trebuchet rock was close. <laughs> the lads aren't even through the front gate yet. Come on. Something is going on at the top of this tower. Or is it? More of enemies to cut through, apparently. What is going on? There's rocks. Don't mind if I do. Catch! Oh. I think I threw it at the wall. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? I go up top. Here we go. We should get a really nice angle up here, lads. Right. Let's just stand over here. And... Oh, I don't know my own strength sometimes. Right. <laughs> Do we test our brand new fall perk and see if we land nicely down and start cutting them like a ninja? Or if we break our legs and die? For science! Oh no, we broke our legs and died. <laughs> it was quite the drop. <laughs> Not to self, lads. Maybe try a smaller drop. <laughs> but it was for science. Sometimes you gotta know these things, you know? If we didn't do half the stuff we did in history, we would have never have known how stuff works. <laughs> All right, so we are going to march on this final castle but here. And this will line us up nicely for an attack on the battalions going forward. All right, men, let's bring down this castle. I think this is actually a former battalion castle rather than a sturgeon. Hence the different design. But this will be the last of the castles and the great sturgeon war will come to an end. You have my word, men. I will release you from your oaths and you can go back home. Although we still have many enemies. So actually, I don't know if I can fulfill that. <laughs> you know what? I will release you all. Mainly because we're going to have to do some recruiting ourselves anyway. So, we'll take this castle down and we'll have a bit of a break. <laughs> you deserve it, men. I think the lads are eager to go home. They've just run in and massacred the Sturgeons. Alright, for science, lads. We only took two damage from that fall. Okay. So our fall distance is somewhere between jumping off a little, like, roof and jumping off a castle keep. <laughs> We need to, like, fine-tune the distance we can fall before dying. Good to know, though, it's somewhere between a gatehouse and a little, like, <laughs> a little roof. <laughs> but it looks like this siege is over already. And that is it. The Great Sturgeon War has come to an end. They only have one castle and one settlement remaining. But we have too many enemies, too many fights going on. We need to focus on other things right now.
But not only that, something truly devastating has happened. This might be the worst thing that has happened yet. The Asarai have declared war on us. They were peaceful. We left them to sit there, but they've decided that now that the world is at war with us, they were going to try their hand and take advantage of the situation. So, I think we're going to have to march on the Asarai at some point. We were going to let you live, my friends. Or I am sorry. You have gone too far. But now we have an entry point into Britannia so we can start the Britannian invasion. Or we can move on with the Western Empire invasion. Either way, that's one of the two that's next. We're going to disband the army, let everyone recruit. Numbers are thinning a little bit. I need to go back home and do some recruiting as well. But overall, progress has been made, you know. We are making progress. It won't be long till the world is completely green. But that is going to be it for now. As always, a big thank you to the Gwaggles members for your support. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, and until next time, see ya.